A coronavirus has meant that many people may have had to cancel vacations or travel this holiday weekend. But as Local 5's Eva Anderson tells us, even local travel has taken a real hit, with campgrounds here in Iowa suffering. Growing up in Iowa, my Memorial Day weekends were almost always spent at Iowa campgrounds. And behind me, you can see a lot of empty camping sites here at KOA Holiday in Adel. They tell me it will start to get full this weekend, but still, the coronavirus means that they won't quite get the business they normally do on one of their biggest holiday weekends of the year. It's been difficult finding places to camp until now. Luke Gruber is a little behind on his camping for this season. Usually by this time of year we've been out several times for the year but not this year. This is really the the first time out. The RV owner says he's seeing COVID-19's impact on KOA holiday in Adel. A lot less people than usual. The slow start echoed by the campground's well, owner. Uh, right now we're down 60 percent just for this weekend. Chris Rademacher says cabin reservations are hit the hardest, while camp sites are only slightly down. But he said it's been hard for families to plan their weekends away, not knowing how the governor's restrictions will affect the availability of popular camp amenities. Now we've got you know pools and playgrounds that aren't allowed to be open still uh, through the 27th, and it's just like this ever-changing dynamic. So people don't want to base their entire three-day vacation on an uncertainty. Another summer uncertainty: city pools. Des Moines Parks and Rec tell me they'll decide by late May whether or not to open their pools in 2020. But in Clive, they've already made the decision to stay closed the entire summer. You got to assume the risk, you know, if you're going to go to these places, unfortunately. Chris says for now, he'll keep doing his part to keep his campground clean and safe for campers like Luke. And just hopefully that each of these places are, are taking this stuff, you know, seriously and, you know, keeping things clean. Chris tells me as people begin to venture out of their houses and as weeks pass by and restrictions are lifted, he actually expects a big boom in business by the end of the camping season. In Adele, Eva Anderson, Local 5 News, We Are Iowa.